You too. What do you think of this purple? You think it's a good purple? I like it, but I do some pinch to wake it up. <laughs> some sort of accents? Some, like, Some sort gold, of accent. Gold would look awesome. Gold would look, gold would look good. Yeah. Just curious, see what people think of purple. I like it. I like it. Have a good day, Annie. You too. Would not do a gold pinstripe. Gold would look not good. It would look very 70s, would not do gold. What's up YouTube? Today we're here with the Dodge Charger Hellcat again and we are going to do my favorite part which is tinting the windows. I've been a window tinter for about nine years now so I'm very excited to do this. In fact we've had the car for about a week now and it's been driving me crazy that we don't have the windows tinted but we've been so busy at the shop we haven't had a chance to do it. So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to use our Expel XR Prime series of window film. That's a ceramic line of tint and it's going to look awesome, it has a lifetime warranty, and it's also going to block a lot of heat from coming into the car. That helps keep you more comfortable when you're driving, it helps the AC run a lot more effectively. So this is Dean, he's going to be helping us out, he's one of our installation technicians here at Blackout. He does everything from tinting buildings, tinting cars, installing paint protection film, does some sales stuff and customer service stuff as well. So if you stop into the shop, it's a good possibility you might be talking to Dean. He's going to be helping me tint the car today. We move a lot faster with two people, we always usually work in a team of two. And we're going to be removing the door panels and prepping the glass. Now we're going to catch a lot of crap for removing the door panels from other window tinters. We know that. We don't care. We can tint the car with the panels on. We can tint it with the panels off. What we found in our experience is we tint a lot better when the panels are off. We get cleaner results. We work quicker. Um, overall, we don't want to cut corners. We don't want to end up with small little wrinkles and things like that. So this helps us do that a lot more effectively. At this point, we've tinted over 12,000 vehicles here at Blackout, and this is pretty much standard operating procedure for us. This is our Expel DAP software, and you can see there's a database here. Um, we're going to pick our vehicle, 2016 Dodge Charger SRT Hellcat. Now, for purposes of the window tint, it doesn't really matter um, what submodel we pick. All of the chargers have the same glass. However, you can see if we were installing paint protection film, there's a lot of there's a lot of paint protection kits there, and some of those are submodel specific. We use a peel board here that allows us to have a controlled area that we keep constantly clean, so the dirt and debris isn't flowing onto our film as we remove the liner. Some people you'll see them peel it in their hand in the air. Uh, that's an effective way to do it as well. Some people use the car to peel the, the film. Um, only problem with that is the car has to be really clean as well because wherever you spray that water, dirt can run down onto the film. And then once it's installed, it looks like little bubbles all over the place. So I'm cleaning the outside of the window for a couple of reasons. Number one, we're going to prep the tint so that it fits on the inside of the glass. What I mean by that is that's a three-dimensional curve. Um, it's, we call a compound curve. The film is a two-dimensional product. We need to get it into the shape of that window before we try to install it on the inside of the glass. And number two, um, we need a clean surface so that when we do go to install it, we can see what we're doing, what we still need to squeegee, and if there's any dirt or debris underneath the film. So something that comes up with us a lot is a lot of people think that their factory windows are completely clear. Um, they're not. There is a slight tint to any car. And on the charger, let's see what we're looking at. So you can see the factory clear glass is actually 78%. That means 78% of light is passing through the window. So we're going to be putting a 20% window film on the charger today. Pretty standard percentage. Um, we use that film probably more than anything. The rear section of a truck or an SUV, if you buy it from the factory, especially American-made vehicles, is usually right around a 20%. So we're going to put the 20% on this whole car all the way around. It's going to look really good. Still going to be able to see out of it. Still going to be able to see in on a bright day, see a silhouette of somebody that's in the car. A lot of times I'll do a limo tint on some of my personal vehicles, sort of a bad habit of mine. I love the way that it looks. This car we do plan on flipping at some point and getting rid of it. A lot of people don't like tint that dog. Break it. Wait till you go to take all these little bits out. That's just like my car. That's no different. Except with that one, you could actually get the covers off. Thanks 
thanks to Mr. Dean Mitchell from Canada for these awesome window tint patterns. Oh, wow. You have to hit every single defroster. If you miss a spot, we're gonna have to fight a finger for 30 minutes, and I hate doing that. Mm -hmm. um, do it three times, as hard as you can. Your arm is going to hurt. You're not gonna be able to breathe because it's alcohol. But when you're done, should be good. Then scrubbing it twice. Yeah, that's a good idea. about that. One of your hands and then you're gonna have to get an arm under, up underneath it, so. Ready? Mm -hmm. Are you aware of it a little? Okay. Off over the top, watch the headliner, watch the seat. And don't wait for it. Go in as low as I can. I'm gonna need a brand new blade and a uh, stainless blade, please. Well, I'm probably down here. That's good. Okay, guys, thank you very much for watching. As you can see, our Charger Hellcat is now tinted with the Expel Prime XR ceramic window film. We did a 20% tint all the way around. It looks really aggressive. It's going to block heat, and it comes with a lifetime warranty. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more great content about our Hellcat.